right this way, my lady. Here you go, a seat right here. Oh, thank you. Here is your menu. Thank you so much. Huh? Huh? Hmm. Which do you recommend? This one? Mm-hmm. Wow, that's such a great performance. Huh? Oh, he texted. Hey, babe, I'm glad you came out to the show tonight. But uh, please be careful. I'm already worried about... I mean, I know you're new down here. A lot of demons will see you as fresh meat, so just be safe. I'll try to keep an eye on you. My next set is in five. Gotta go. Love you, toots. It seems like my angel cakes has brought in someone special. Do me a favor, baby. Take her one of daddy's special drinks. Yes. Here you go. Oh, this isn't the one I ordered, though. Oh, trust me. This one is much better. It's a sweet free blend, and you can barely taste the alcohol. Oh, uh, okay. So good. <laughs> well, hello there, little bird. Never have seen you around. Come to enjoy some quality entertainment. Oh, I uh, yeah. I just wanted to come and see one of my friends dance is all. Oh, how fun! You know we got some of the best dancers in hell. You know my angel? <laughs> oh, yeah, I know. Angels tell me all the time about how good everyone is. But he's the best in my opinion. Most definitely. He's the biggest star in all of hell. But why don't you come have a seat with me over here? Let's both talk for a while. Oh, f oh, f oh, f oh, f mm. oh, come on now, little bird. I can see the hesitation in your eyes. Don't worry. I don't bite. Too hard. But I. Uh. uh... Ha! No. <laughs> <laughs> No, 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 no! Angel. <laughs> Someone help! Hmm. <laughs> so, tell me, how long have you and Angel known each other? I've never heard him speak of you, and... I've never seen you around these parts. Yeah. Um, sort of new being down here. I I've only been here for maybe five months. Yeah, something like that. How long have you- Oh, so you're brand new down here. Barely even scratch the surface of being here, huh? How did you meet my little angel cakes? Oh! Pretty much still kind of learning the ropes down here. We met when I first fell down here. Bumped into him. I moved in with him and the rest is pretty much history. He's taking me under his ring for the time being. So I've moved in with him in the hotel for now. Just until I can get back on my feet. But yeah, it's been pretty great with... Um, being around him and getting to know him better. He's... An amazing friend, and all, if I'm honest, not just because of you know the, the sex stuff, but he's a good mentor with teaching me how to dance and how to stay safe. Just, just for now. How interesting! You moved in with him. That's not like him at all. <laughs> so odd. Usually he's. Pretty chatty about who he takes in. Complains all the time about roommates. But that's a whore for ya. Always complaining. I'm sure you know that by now. Yeah, um, definitely. But I mean, Angel isn't all that bad. He doesn't complain as much as I think you're thinking. 
We mostly just chill, ch chill and watch movies. Maybe gossip about, about certain things. Hmm. Kinda sad he's been hiding such a beautiful creature from the outside world. But I can see why. I'm surprised demons haven't been bothering you much. You have a rather exotic look to you. Not many griffin demons down here. And definitely not as small as you. <laughs> hmm. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome our star of the night, Angel Dust! <laughs> Watching him dance, don't you? Uh, oh, sh I'm sorry. Got lost for a second there. <laughs> but, but yes, I really do love the chances I get to watch him perform. He does it so well and perfect. Sometimes it makes me miss dancing. Only sometimes. Oh. You were a performer yourself? Yeah, for nearly a decade. It was a huge passion of mine. Being the center of attention and the lights, the fame, the money, and more. It was just perfect. And you don't want to go back to doing that? Uh, well, I mean, I, I, I do. Just kind of scared to put myself back out there. Being as where I am and such, I, uh, kind of hard. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you. It would be possible to get you back out there. See it as a little favor, almost. Uh, well... Now, you listen to me closely, Azura. I cannot stress enough to you about this. I'll be damned if I let that rat take anyone else away from me. I'm trusting you and myself to keep you a safe distance and at least out of eye view of that bastard. If I let you come watch me at the club, you need to promise me you'll be safe about it. Don't even let any other random demons trying to come talk to you. Some real creeps out there you don't need to be around. I already am hesitant since you're new down here and don't really understand how it works yet. Some real pieces of shit that'll try to snatch you up seeing as you're unique looking. Angel, I promise I'm going to stay safe as I can. I'll sit close to the stage if there's room. I want to be right where you are. And where I can see you and you can see me. So that way if something does happen, you'll be there, right? Huh. Yeah, that's right. I'll be there. I just want to keep you safe and protect you. I don't even feel you should be down here in this hellhole to begin with. But I feel it's my duty to keep you safe here and with me in the hotel. No one can hurt you here. Promise. But if something happens at the club, run. Don't look back and just keep running. You know how manipulative and convincing he can be. He gets in your head trying to mess things up. You cannot accept anything he offers to you. No deals, no contracts, nothing. Don't let him use any of his charm and his money and his promises or any of that bullshit trying to get through to you. So many promises that are never kept. Trust me, I'll keep you safe, Zuzu. Oh, thank you, Angel. Thank you for helping me. I promise I'll be all right. I'll call if anything happens or changes. So what do you say, baby bird? Go back to the way things used to be? <laughs> well... I can guarantee you will not be disappointed. Um, well, I think it's, it, it would have to be... Um, <clears throat> Well, I think it would be absolutely amazing to get back into. I think I'm ready to leave that life behind me. For now. <laughs> oh, come on, baby. Let me take a wild guess and say, Angel told you some things about me. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if he did, but who's to say any of it's true? Let's make some magic together, sugar. Let me take care of you. I appreciate the offer. 
I really do, but I'll have to pass for now. I got other plans in, in my turns of finding work. But have a good night. Thank you for the drink and the talk. Ouch! I, uh... No, 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 no! Leaving so soon, baby? Stay for a while. Let's talk a bit more about this. No need to make such a big decision within seconds of being offered. But... but I... We can also watch Angel together. Relax, baby. Just come and enjoy yourself for a while. Damn it, fuck shit, you goddamn shit, shit, shit. Hmm? Now, now, Angel. Going somewhere? Me and you both know how Val feels about you interrupting his business. Stay out of this, Fox! She wants nothing to do with him, and I'm putting an end to it right now. Back off! Angel! <laughs> Oh, rather brave of you to assume I would just let you go so easily. Vox, please! You know how bad he can get, and I don't want that for her! Please, just let me go help her! Don't do this! Let go of me! Hey! No, 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 no! I'm sorry, Angel! <laughs> God, you little sh! Get her! Uh, uh, Angel! Ah, uh, oh, come on, baby. We weren't done playing, leaving so soon. Rude. Come on, honestly. Yeah. Besides, now look at you, Angel. Being in the way like you always are. What's to say we go have a convo in my office? Fun, right? Come on! Uh, Angel! No, please! I'm sorry! Don't let him take the angel! <laughs> <laughs>